Specification, location, maintenance, operation, testing, railway track, scan, scales, Association of American Railroads, um, Chapter 1, Section 1, 1, Locations 1, 1, 1, General Condition, the proper location of the track scales depend primarily on the following condition of the bottom track to be weighed comparison, which switch over to the square scales not to be weighed. Location of the scales in much use used by the track may increase the cost of maintenance and inspection testing whether the cars will be separate um, switched to a separate track for weighing where static weighing is done where the t track time for testing maintenance is limited to run around the track may be desirable whether cars are to be weighed in motion in the scale location may be must be carefully selected and considered the training operation weighing requirements and maintenance testing the cost in switching the cost of maintenance is necessity necessity of quick dispatch cars that are weighed with if overload, etc. The cost of downtime for maintenance and testing track scale. One one two, the alignment of the dead weight rails. Amended in two thousand six. Dead rails should be provided with all scales and with a dead capacity. The weighing system does not correspond with the greatest combined load likely to be crossed over the weight weigh rails of the volume of the traffic not being weighed as great of the rails should be installed and as outlined below. Static scales the whale the well the way of the rails shall in, in, installed in the offset track the dead, dead rails should be installed in line with the main track. Motion scale the way of the rail way rails should be installed in the line with the main line track the dead rails should be installed with the offset track. 113 factors of motion and weighing. The following must be considered vertical curvature approaching the scale, the scale length of the scale gradient before crossing and after the scale vertical curvature beyond the scale scale response time and distance between the scale and point restricted in the train car movement. Identify the car weighed. Use the weight and scale and commodity assigned the freight cars overload detection adjustment Automatic adjustment for retard is etc. 114 gradient of static weight. When weighing at a static scale, the gradient track and drag for at least one car length is each direction of the scale shall be the same as the way the way of the rest. 1-2. Maintenance and operation. 1-2-1. One, one, number of scales. All track scales should be referred to by owner and number of location. 1-2-2. Two, two, major mechanical scale repairs. Major scale scale. Renewal sharpening points should be made with the scale repair shop, which has facilities for the controlling pivot gauge of the range and alignment. One, two, three, cleaning. To ensure proper operation of the wing of the bridge, scale parts or substructure foundation should be cleaned as necessary to ensure the proper operation. One, two, four, rust prevention for pivots and bearing steel. The, bear, the best rust prevention optimal should be applied for the pivots and bearing steel. However, it should be so applied not to interfere with the proper function of the scale. 125 Corrosion Prevention. A scale mechanism structural seals should be treated with often even enough to prevent corrosion. 126 Removal of Ice. Amendment of 2013. Ice obstruction of the scale should be removed by the heat and non application of the salt, any other corrosive metal. If the application of the heat to remove the ice or care must be exercised not to damage electrical wiring, loading cells, electrical equipment that is adequate drainage. 127 weighing and approaching rails the way the way rail should be um, smooth straight and without joints without throughout the entire length surface alignment must be provided preserved between the ends of the approach and weighing the rails the gap between the approach of the way rails way rails shall be maintained not less than one eighth of an inch or four millimeters should not exceed five eighths of an inch 16 millimeters the gap should be protected against the change by using the extents and some joints and other suitable means in the, in the appropriate uh, pr approach track. 128 Way Beam. The way beam shall be balanced for the scale is used. Well, when not in use, it should be secured for the beam lock. The poise shall be set with the maximum gradient. 129 Standard of standing, standing of equipment and prohibited. Equipment should be not allowed to stand on the scale except when being weighed. Oil and sand and debris from the locomotive or other equipment deteriorate detrimental to the operation of the scale should be removed. 1 2 10 restriction on the use of the way of the rail scales equipped with the dead rail rails. Engine and similar heavy vehicles uh, must not be passed through the way rails except for the authority department having supervision over the installation maintenance of the scales and necessary movement of the cars of the way rails should be prohibited. The cars have been passed beyond the dead rails, which which must be not returned over the way of the rails. The dead rails shall be set for the over the, for the dead rail track except for the when the cars are weighed, when the coupling of which have been stopped on the scale impact most and not exceed two miles an hour. One two one one two eleven. Cars on way rails. Cars on way rails must not be moved by car engines, cars or engines on the dead rails, or vice versa. Cars must not be moved over the scale. One of with one truck on the way rails and the other truck on the dead rails. One two twelve. Use of sand. Slipping in locomotive wheels on the way and dead rails injuries to structure. Only the sufficient amount of sand to provide with the necessary traction shall be applied. 
One, two, thirteen, stopping car on the scales of minute 2012. Car locomotive should not be suddenly stopped on the scales. Impact choking of the violent braking application. Locomotive should not be marked on the scale. One, two, fourteen, inspection wares. The wares should be familiar with the construction scale, the making of the inspection, such as intervals necessary to determine the scale in proper working condition. The way in any way, only one appointed with the inspector cleaning the scale should properly be instructed if desired that they present the scale inspector with the scale tested. 1 2 15 security of the scale hose scale hoses beam boxes should be kept locked when not in use section 13 testing 131 testing frequency Trash scales regular weighing services shall be tested at least once a year the frequency of which the tests are conducted depend upon the amount of weight performed the character's amount of the paint is given in the scale and the paint presence of errors and lack of them shown the results of successive tests 1 4 equipment for testing Set 141, standard of, standards of mass. The standards of mass test cars should be designed with the manufacturer in accordance with the Association of American Railroad Specification for Test Cars calibration made for the National Institute of Standards and Tr Technology Class 5, class, sorry, Class F tolerance for part 1 part in 1 10,000. Section 15 Specification of Railway Tracks Scale Test Wayloads 151 General Guidelines The test wayload is traceable standards with the use to determine the accuracy of the railway scales. All equipment used for the testing railway scale should be designed and maintained and operated in a safe manner. 152 Classification Certified Mass Standards Traceable to the National Institute of Standard and Tr Standards and Technology Classified in two categories according to these designs. Use calibrated certifi certified railway scales, composite railway cars, test weight, weight, weight railway car, test weight railway cart. B. Used to verify the scales of accuracy certified standard railway car. Rail car. All right, one five primary requirements. The nominal weight of the certified mass standard of the static testing of the railway track class scale is defined in section 186. Shall not be less than 80,000 pounds. The nominal weight of any certified mass standard used in an intermittent test as described in section 188 shall not be less than 30,000 pounds. 154 composite car. The test rate weight load design and the certified mass standard is supported by two acts of the following design characteristics. A metal construction wheel, wheel, wheel base not exceeding 7 feet and having a uniform load distribu distribu distribution. No unnecessary equipment. A minimum of ledge is a cap to these projection, projections of a whole dirt, water, and other foreign matter. The collabor calibration cavity with, must be waterproof and sealable. The minimum of surface area of the smooth slope top to ensure the drainage. Accessibility of all parts of the inspection. And uh, ruggedness, durability, in order to minimize repairs. One five five testing weight railway weight railway car. The tested wayload design and certified mass standard supported by the two axle truck before built by the Association of American Railroad Interchange with the following design characteristics: all metal construction except for the ballast ballast material must be stable. Loading um, points must be not exceed seven feet. Have a uniform load distribution. Distribution no unnecessary equipment. A minimum of ledges, cavities, projection to hold dirt, water, and other foreign material. Calibration cavities capable of holding at least 1,000 pounds must be waterproof and sealable. Operation control is functional and on both sides of the railway car drive system. When used, shall be adequately propelled the car on a 3% grade, smooth and sloped top. To ensure the drain is accessible part of all of the inspection regardless of the durability in accordance with the minimum minimum minimize minimize repairs ups and or 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 overall truck center should not exceed 50 feet site under the handbrake is accessible from the uh, ground fuel tank when used must be attached and not exceed 16 pounds or capacity of two or two gallons lifting system must adequately adequately to lift all the minimum of two inches above the rail Hydraulic oil tank, when used, may be, must be equipped with the sight gauge. The other means to indicate the proper amount of oil maintaining calibration. 156. Testing railway, railway cart. Uh, testing wa weight load of the certified mass standard supported with the two axle steel wheels with the following design characteristics. All metal construction wheel base not, uh, wheel base not exceeding 7 feet from the uniform load of distribution. No unnecessary equipment. The minimum ledge is cavities projections holding dirt and water and foreign matter. The calibration captivities of the waterproof and sealable. Minimum surfaces are smooth and sloped at the top to ensure the drainage is accessible of all parts of inspection regarding ruggedness and durability in order to minimize repair. Fuel tank when used must be attached and not exceed 16 pound capacity or 2 gallons. Hydraulic oil tank when used may, must be equipped with a sight gauge or other means to indicate the proper amount of oil maintained calibration. The weight of the car as well as the separate weights must be traceable. 157 standard railway car. 
Standard railway car converted and certified mass stand is supported with about two, two two axle trucks from the Association of American Railroads Interchain Service with the following design characteristics. All metal construction except for the ballast. Ballast material must be stable, load, uniform, distributed over trucks, no unnecessary equipment, minimum ledge cavity projections, hold dirt and water in the farther form matter. The calibration captivity is provided with the mo must be waterproof and sealable, smooth and sloped. Uh, to smooth and slope top to ensure the damage accessibility for all the inspection regardless regardless durability and ordering minimize repairs section 16 maintenance and transportation of track scale test weight cars amended in 2010 one six two main categories. The circumstance of the rail, rail required the test weight cars to be classified in two main categories, mainly test weight cars and terminal test weight cars. Test weight cars are circumstances you may use may be handled normally in road hall movements or other considerable territory. Interchangeable rules may be applicable. The test weight on the cars used for, for field was normally with switching limits to give the locality referred to the terminal weight test weight cars. Um, 162 weight control. Generally, all the test weight controls are required to maintain accurately to their design normal weight values. The purpose of each of the cars is to be corrected to close to the euro error to the particular certified with the class 5 tolerances as often as may be required. Such so certification shall be conducted on a master scale and has been tested and calibrated with all the standards traceable by the National Institute of Standard and Technology equal nominal ma mass and nominal mass of the test weight car or by comparison with the nominal traceable standards on a mechanical railroad track scale with adequate sensitivity a test weight car should be constructed considered unsatisfactory with the certified mass standard if it is actually weighed differs in excess or deficiency of a nominal weight more than 16 pounds. The foregoing paragraph is intended to literally application from the United States both in Canada and Mexico and should govern permissible limits of the var variation unless modified with the existing law of the government regulation. Responsibility of weight control. The scale inspector in charge with each of the car shall be responsible for the weight of the control interval between the successive certifications. It shall be the duty to supervise all the repairs, recommendation, of advisable modification, addition with the anti, -anti anticipation of the Association of American Railroad interchange rules. The scale inspector should weigh all the parts of the modification change to the car to be in route between the certifications over the head and the recalibrated following the modification changes. He shall either attend lubricating or supervise the super such since lubrica lubrication is an important factor of the weight control varied degree in the different cars he shall shield redo the re regard with the requirement of each get your car take necessary measures to maintain adequate supply of lubricant to keep the weight of the car within the prescribed limits of the variation all variables hydraulic li li fluid engine oil etc shall be maintained check before each scale each scale test calibration C. Frequency and certification test of the weight cars should be certified at least annually. The frequency certification terminal weight test weight cars in special cases and may be extended within the required approvals. Certification files repairs. All test weight of the cars shall be certified with the following major repairs of the damage or wear following the repairs alterations of any kind that involve weighing changes that could be confidentially controlled by the weighing removed by the applied material. Classification of repairs. Repairs test weight cars shall be classified either by major, major or minor repairs. Um, major repairs require a sort of recertification that includes the repair and replacement of the wheels, axles, roller bearing assembly, journal boxes, draft gear, couplers, replacement of lost, destroyed parts where whose weight is unknown, whose replacement is likely to cause the weight variation greater than allowable. The repair of the general nature of subsequent to the damage, derailation, collision, or like painting. Minimum requirements may include the lubrication replacement of the bolts and nut and grab irons, air hose, the air hose fitting, the knuckles, brake rigging, journal braces, brasses, springs, and other parts known weight. Three recorded repairs, a historical record of redistributing, describing the nature of all the repairs shall be maintained. Simple electric springs. If the test weight of the car is equipped with semi-elliptical springs, each spring which, when installed, shall have its weight stamped, otherwise permanently marked on the band. If the spare spring is okay, are carried, each shall be marked in its weight. Air equipment. Test weight equipped with air operated brakes shall be having equipment inspected, cleaned with the repaired necessary lubricated stencil in the time of the certification. In any event, such of the work shall be done in such a period of exam. Expiration intervals allow with the maximum air association American Railroad interchange of the rules for the operating without the inspection will not occur with the, with the car and the testing trip. H. Removable foreign materials. Test weight carries accumulation of snow and ice and sleet must be used. For test, must not be used for testing. Frozen matter may, may be removed either by placing the car in a heated building or using steam. Removal by the use of salt and chemicals is not, again, not acceptable. Oil and dirt in the car wheels should be removed. Suitable means. Accumulated moisture in closed compartments shall be removed whenever the circumstances require. 
the painting. The test of the weight cart it shall be um, kept well painted. Surplus landing. Artificial uh, articles such as car movers, tools, and personal effects, etc., shall not be included with the nominal weight. The test weight of the car's so items shall be removed with the test weight of the cars being used for the scale t testing purposes. K. Inspection preceding test. Test weight cards shall be examined. The scale inspector immediately before the each of the tests is determined that there are any damage missing parts. If there is unauthorized substitution of parts that may be after the calibration of the testing weight of the car. Date of last certification. The most recent certification date is has the sensor on both sides of the test car. That scale inspector shall have the current certification calibration. Yard handling test weight of the car shall be protected, but the rough handling at all times should not be humped. And they should be not be using the hump scales without proper safety and precautions per warning of the potential runaways. Impacts of speed greater than two miles an hour should be avoided. When in motion, uncoupled trains from the train, the test weight cars and brakes shall not be maintained. Manned, the brakes will shall be firmly set after the motion stopped. The fuel level. The fuel level tank is a test weight car and it shall be filled with more before the start of the scale and test. The way of calibration of fuel level maintained is appropriate. Section 1-7. Disposition of track scales. 171. Removed track scales. The track scale which has been removed um, reason for the inaccuracy and insufficient capacity should be disposed of in either or following way. Treated scrap metal after running on the uncertified scales part of the Thero with the unit for their use. Re retain functional parts for the use of the repair parts in the existing scale for the same time scale. Same type in size. 1-8. Static testing the railway track scale. 181 testing equipment amended 2013. A test weight loaded is separate as a term used in here in the railway car, car constructed, operated, and maintained in accordance with the applicable specification rules approved by the Association of American Railroads. See Section 15 Specification of Railway Track Scales. The test weight of loads amended 2008. Section 16 Maintenance of the Transportation Track Scale. Test weight of cars amended 2010. And the test weight load of um, B shall be 80,000 less 80,000 pounds or greater. Um, Testing weight loads are traceable to the National Intense Institute of Standards and Technology Tech Standards should be made, should be used in determining testing section 188. Scale inspection. The scale should be thoroughly checked with any obstructions, blind, binds, or other conditions that could be affected by the test of the result. Any such condition found with the recorded on the report is found. The test should be conducted before any of the adjustments of the repairs initiated. 183 zero balance uh, zero load balance amended 2013 automatic zero train trace tracking mechanism shall be displayed prior to the conducting of the test as found in zero balance condition of the scale should be noted and recorded with the test report form the scale inspector before adjusting the repair any out out of balance condition should be corrected with the scale zero before the testing of the place waste is low test weight load on the scale the zero load basing Balance should be observed and recorded by each time the test weight loaded and removed with the scale during the test process. The zero should shall not interchange or more minimum applicable tolerance each time the test weight load is removed from the scale that is found as left the zero balance reading shall be recorded. 184 sensitivity requirement or SR test. Sensitivity the sensitivity sh shall be conducted only on non automatic indicated weigh beams. Ascending scale sensitive requirement testing shall be made very, very low, uh, zero load maximum test load applied to the scale either by increasing or decreasing the amount of test weight load on the load receiving element of the scale. Following the minimum response shall be the same maintenance and acceptance of the test of the scale. A scale with a trig loop but with uh, without a balance indicator of the position rest of the weigh beam shall be changed from the horizontal midway beam between limiting stopping either stop way beams not marked with the three or three l that um st sensitive requirement shall not exceed three m times the value of the minimum graduated l level in which the way beam or 100 pounds whichever is left the way beam of the three and a three l the sensitive requirement shall not exceed one uh, requirement test shall not exceed one minimum division of way beam zero load two minimum divisions of way beam for the maximum test load a scale of a single balance indicated with the position of the rest of the indicator shall change Lace one division on the graduated scale with the width of the central or the target area with whichever is greater. 185 Discrimination Test Amendment of the 2012. The discrimination test should be conducted with the automatic indicating scale with the weighing device the equilibrium near the zero load of the new or maximum test load uncontrolled conditions with environmental factors are reduced for the extent of the will not affect the result obtained with the scales equipped with the automatic zero tracking mechanisms AZTM. Um, the discrimination test may be conducted with the range of the automatic zero tracking technique.
Nickel tracking mechan mechan mechanism range on a digital server. The test is conducted with the just below the lower edge of the zone. Uncertainty of the increasing load testing and just above the upper edge of the zone for the uncertainty decreasing load testing. The test load equivalent to 1.4 division, division shall cause the change in indication valve of at least 2.0 division that requires the zone uncertainty shall not to be not greater than three tenths of the value of the scale division. 186 static testing of the track scale in 2013. Ship tests required to ensure the scale performance with the applicable tolerance to verify the railway car can be accurately weighed from any direction, any position of the scale. The ship test should be conducted as found with both the directions before any of the repairs adjustments are made as found as left. And reading that shall be required not less than 80,000 pounds may be used for the track certification except with internal improvement. Approval returning the scale temporary of the service after the repairs. The section of the railway track shall be numbered 1, 2, 3, 4, etc. Left to the right with the same of the wing and indicate or facing the scale deck normal section placement position and scale testing way load. When performing the shift of the test are designated in order left to right viewed with the wing indicator 1 left, 1 right, 2 left, 2 right, 2, um, two, two R, 3 left, 3 R, 3 R. 3 3 are the nominate pre pre um, pre representation letters are fixed indicated with the body of the testing way load in the left or right section with one or more of the wheels jacked directly over the location of the following standard combination of the nominal test weight load placement position using a four section scale as an example any one of the combination may be used while conducting the standard track scale with a shifting test 1 R 2 R 2 and R 1 2 R 2 R one, sorry, 1, 2, and 3, and 4L, 1R, 2L, 2R, 3L, 3R, 4L. When testing two, two section, the standard combination of normal testing proceed, position is 1R, 2 center, 2L. Note, when using self-propelled testing cars, the following additional testing procedure may be used. Place the entire car with the jacks retract from the left center, right end of the scale, load and the receiving element, test the weight of the cars can be uncoupled to both ends of the void of the air. Coupler error. All right, 187 strain test amended 2013. In addition with the standard test, section 81186, the scale should be strained. Strain test using the load and the scale test test weight and the load known to the test weight the load based on the scale weight is recorded the test weight loaded the test weight is then added so the load of the test weight are the are on the scale record the combination weight the subtract load weight from the combined weight of the load and test weight the difference between the value of the load and load plus the weight of the should be equal to the value of the test weight and if not the deviation must not be applicable challenge as applied to the west uh, test weight. One half of the railway car can be used and loaded with a scale and too short accommodation entire rail car plus the test weight load or test weight. 188. Interim testing amended to 2008 9. Interim testing allows the track scale to be temporarily pending on the test conducted with the corners with section 1 8 using the test weight load of no less than 80,000 pounds. The time period of the temporary use of the discretion is um, the testing of the railroad. Interim test using a certified test weighing load not less than 30,000 pounds. The strain test not less than 25,000 pounds of scale capacity may be used to return the scale and service the following emergency repairs. The interim test shall be included that all the tests outlined in section. 1A, the testing railroad, an official statutory authority for the immunizated to notify with the scales are repaired and placed in the service and determined in test. 189 test record. The result of the test should be recorded with a suitable report form. The following information shall be shown. Data of the test signature inspected the following complete identification scale shall include the scale owner's name, the address, some of the identification location facilities, and there is more one scale identification, nominal weight calibration, data test weight load, balance condition is found with the inspector upon arrival. Each of the test weight load is removed from the scale except for the during a calibration result of the test from the before adjustment of the repairs, the reading of the errors, the error, minimum graduations, and value of the sensitive require. Sensitive re sensitivity requirement, zero load, maximum applied load, any defective condition during the inspection test of the scale, any action taken the calibration adjustment repairs at the time of the test are effectively to effective conditions found in the existing scale mechanism structure. Result of the test rating errors near the minimum of the graduation after the making adjustment correction of the scale mechanism and structure. Recommendation of the inspector in addition to information required for the testing agent, seal numbers, witnessing unusual conditions, affecting the test, etc. 1810 tolerances are made in 2012. Every track shall be kept with the closest possibility adjustment. The weighing performance shall be considered men and satisfactory. The scale is not maintained with the appropriate tolerance for the set forth therein. Formally adopted tolerance and excess deficiencies only on a static railway track test. The track scales use, use commercial devices and files. My, my, 
Ma ma uh, maintenance tolerance table one accuracy class three of the L static maintenance tolerance test load 050 tolerance division one 501 to one um, 1000 test load division tolerance division two add scale one division tolerance for either additional 500 division for the test load fraction thereof Acceptable tolerance shall not be exceed one half of the maintenance tolerance for any of the position test weight load of the scale. The minimum test weight load shall be allowed or applied shall be 80,000 pounds. Acceptable tolerance is not applied for the following testing situations. One first official test for the track scale. The first field the test at, um, first field test after the scale adjustment the rejection of the failure must be performance requirements to return the scale to service after the repairs overhaul and terminate and test. Testing the track scale using the reference set scale wearing the verification verification scale to test and care certify another scale. Shifting section the range of the result ordinate or obtained during the shifting test section test shall not exceed the absolute value of the maintenance tolerance of each of the test results shall be applicable tolerance. Repeatable test result obtained with the several weightments of the same load with the same position of the scale shall agree with the absolute value of the maintenance tolerance of the load. Each weight result shall be within an app uh, uh, applicable tolerances. Section 19 Standard test for the in motion railway car weighing system and amended in 2004. In 19 General Guidelines, information contained with the section applies to all types of in-motion weighing of the single draft system record weights, while entire railway car scale borne, well, whereas multiple draft system require, record weights in summing the railway car axle and truck weights. A general inspection of the weighing system include, included the approaching track scale and instrumentation should be before proceeding in the in-motion test. Test strength should be weighed in once in each of the mode of the operation as found within weight motion, making any static in the motion adjustment. Adjustment. See, a test equipment is used for the motion. The test should be represented with the range of the weight and commodities used during the normal operation weighing system. The reference weighing system can be used in motion. The test should be uncoupled to the open and static reference weight and scales should be obtained in the reference weights and should be tested with the specified 1 8 the reference cars where L should be obtained with a single draft scale with the practical axle well scale. Axle weight scales should not be used to obtain the reference car weights. The static test should be performed in one in the weighing motion weighing system, but an adjustment made at, as testing should be conducted in continuing the conditions such as rain, snow, and ice, and adversely affect the weight of the towers before in motion is completed. 192 testing equipment. The following equipment may be used in the motion test and weighing system provided with the equipment is free def defects. Um, certified testing weight cars, special railway cars meeting the specifications section 15. Reference weight car is the standard weight rail car has been statistically weighed on temporarily used for the manager's and mass standardized and over the short period of time, typically the time required is the S1 scale. Monitoring weight car, a standard railway car filled with a sta sta stable material permanently sealed. These cars are typically used in reference weight cars and monitor the scale performance. 193 Uncoupled in motion testing procedure. The car speed direction of the travel shall be in the same as the way it scales no, no, normal use. Minimum in motion test should be three cars weighed and three times after final adjustment. 194 Coupled in motion testing procedure. The weighing system should be tested with the modes of the locomotive, either the pushing and pulling the car's designated speed in the proper direction. The motion of the test should be conducted with the test train outlined. Weighing system used by the weight train in order of less than 10 ca cars. The weighing system should be tested using a consecutive car train consisting of the number of trains, number of cars weighed in normal operation weight with the minimum of the five times each of the mode of operation following the final calibra calibration. Weighing system placed in the service bill prior to the January 1st, 1991, used the weight and interest in the train of 10 more cars. These weigh systems shall be tested with the consecutive car transiting train of not less than 10 cars weighed from the minimum of the five times each mode of operation following fa final fabrication. Um, weighing system placed in service with January 1st, 1991, used the weight trains of 10 or more cars. These weight systems should be tested with the con using consecutive car dress training, not less than 10 cars weighed at a minimum of five times in each mode of the operation following the final calibration. If the official statutory authority determines if necessary, as the use of the test procedure outlined below shall be used.
As used test procedure, a weighing system shall be tested in the manner representing the normal method of operation length of the trains normally weighed. The weighing system may be tested using either a consecutive car testing train length, length typical of the train normally weighed or a distributed car testing train um, typically the normal trains normally weighed. However, the consecutive car testing shorter length may be used provided by the initial verification testing results for a shorter consecutive car of the train agree with the test results distributed with the car full length of the consecutive car train specified below with the initial verification section, the official of the statutory authority shall be re responsible for determining the minimum testing train length to be used in subsequent tests. Initial verification. Initial verification shall be performed in a new weighing of the system whenever the, any of the track structure the operating procedure changes the consecutive car testing the large length of the shorter train normally weighed and the, to be used subsequent verification in the shorter consecutive car the test train testing results shall be counted either the disrupted or distributed car with the consecutive car with the train with the testing length of the typical track is normally weighed with the difference between the total weight of the train representing the normal method of the operation and the weight of the shorter consecutive car train shall not exceed 0.15%. 0.15%. This difference to the test resulting is 0. Point, exceeding 0.15%. This length of shall be consecutive to the car of the testing train with increase in the agreement with 0.15 cents achieved. Percent achieved if any of the adjustment of the weighing system is based upon the use of the short consecutive car testing train shall be offset with the correct bias bias that will be observed between the full length of the test and short consecutive car testing train. Subsequent sub, subsequent verification of the testing train may consist of either a consecutive car train with with a length not less than the used in initial verification of distributed car testing representation in the number of the cars used in normal operation. Distributive car test train, the length of the train shall be typical trains or, nom or, or that are normally weighed. The testing equipment so there should be split into three groups, each group consisting of 10 cars or 10% of the train length, whichever is less. The test group the, shall be placed in front and near the front, in the middle, and near the end of the train. The following final adjustment distributed car track of the train shall be weighed at least three times, shall be produced 50 weight, 50 weight values, whichever is greater. The weighting system shall be placed in each moderate mode of operation. Consecutive car testing train. A consecutive car train consists of at least 10 cars. A consecutive train car testing train consists of 10 cars and 20 cars inclusively and shall be weighed a minimum of five times each mode operation following the final calibration. If the consecutive car train consists of more than 20 cars, it shall be weighed at a minimum of three times in each mode operation following the final calibration. 195 tolerances. Um, uncoupled in motion, the basic maintenance and acceptance tolerance of the static verse versus the inmost gross, in motion gross weight for the uncoupled in motion test of a single car shall be not exceed plus or minus basic static maintenance tolerance as stated in 1810A. Coupled in motion of the using single car weights, the basic maintenance of acceptable tolerance shall follow for any of the group of the weights, the error, the sum of the individual weights of the group must be within the sum of the maintenance static tolerance of appropriate weight groups established in 1810A. For, for any single single weight minimum of a group of the weight error shall not exceed the following. No single error may be exceed three times the static maintenance tolerance established in 1810A. No more than 5% of the error may exceed the two times the static maintenance tolerance established in 1810A. No more than 35% of the error may exceed the static maintenance tolerance established in 1810A. Coupled to motion, use the multiple car groups that weigh with the 10 cars more than the train use of the unit train weights. The tolerance stated in 195B1. Shall be applied applied with the group of the cars, unit train, the individual car will shall be printed however the tolerance and applied with the unit errors the individual car with the group of the unit travel to determine the severing er, sever, serving carrier as applicable to loading restriction the trackage routing. For scales used with the weight train less than the five cars, no single car will with the group may exceed the static maintenance tolerance established one eight ten A. All right, 196, frequency of test. Maintenance test is used in procedure 193 and 194 shall be made at least once a year. Motion weight scale, in particular electronic scales, during the first five four months after acceptance shall be frequently monitored to assure the proper performance of reference weight cards shall, can be used in monitoring. This page is intentionally left blank. Part 2, basic specification manufacturing insulation railway track scales, 2013.